So into the first draft attempt, we are going to go with the 4-3-2-1 formation. As you know, team two of Galazzo is out. So we are trying to reach a 127 rating, which is a 94 rated team. Make sure to leave a like if you enjoy the video, subscribe to the channel if you are new. And this is not a great start to the draft. We are going to need a lot of higher rated players and there goes 97 rated Johan Cruyff. Very good for the rating. We also get 94 rated Erling Haaland. Our first defender, there is that new 94 rated Nemanja Vidic. He has 99 shot power as well, which is absolutely crazy. Decent play styles, we are going to take him. And our next centre back is going to be 92 rated Lucio. So very good start to the defence. So if we can get a big right back as well, we get Zhao Cancelo. Can also play left back, which could come in handy later down the line. So we get 87 rated Basha. She has got a higher rated version, but we'll take this version for now. And we'll take a Verbruggen. So it's a bit of a bad start, but we are 91 rated. So take what you will from that. We now get 96 rated Buskas on what is a very bad border. I'm going to put him straight into the team. Very nice to see. So the new Galazzo players are coming out to play. Looks like we are unfortunately going to need a new goalkeeper. We'll take Nadozi for now. But on our reserves, we will be on the lookout for a new goalkeeper. Next up, we get uh, Barnes is the highest rated, so we'll take him. We now get Park Ji Sung, another Golazo Team 2 player. We can take him and we can play him in midfield over the Shearer. Gets us a bit more chemistry. Next up, we get 88 rated Kimmich. Not really what you want to see. He can go in at centre mid as well. Um, so we'll take him, we'll play him instead of this guy. We're running out of chances to get a new goalkeeper. We do pick up 94 rated team of the year Frimpong, which is nice to see. We are going to do this. We're up to a 92, which is decent. Last chance at a new goalkeeper. Unfortunately, we don't get one. We'll take Ayara Zabal, highest rated. Last chance at a new attacker. We get Lionel Messi, not the version we wanted, but that's fine. He could play in the team to get us a bit more chemistry. We now get Mares, 89 rated. Last chance at our new midfielder. We get Rod, who can play. Not too sure if she gets chemistry, though. We will sort that out right at the end. Last chance at some new defenders. This could be a big defender. We get 89 rated Emerson. Okay, so we're only 91 rated. But I reckon we go up to a 92. It's just whether or not we can get the chemistry is the big question. There you have it, it's a 9-2. We do this for plus 4. We actually drop down to a 9-1 doing that. If we play Emerson over Cancelo. And then Rod over Kimmich. Can we play another sentiment? Cloud Maurice doesn't get any chemistry. I think it's going to be prove a little bit difficult to get the chem, but there you have it. It's a it's near enough a one two five to kick things off. Let's get into the next draft attempt. So into the next draft attempt, we're going to go ahead and take the four three one two formation. We are going to start off with a decent captain pick, ninety two rated Raúl, and on a bad border, we're going to get ninety three rated Harry Kane. So that is actually a very good start to the draft. We now get 92 Zico. He can play centre mid as well, which will come in handy. We get Coop Miners here. He will need replacing at some point. We now get 96 rated Zinedine Zidane. And again, another um, midfielder that will need replacing. First a defender is not great. We'll take Pizella at the end. Um, only 76 rated, so don't think he'll make the team. We now get Mappy Leon, which is decent for the rating. We are going to need to see 90 plus. 
and I believe Onobache is 90 plus, 95 rated, can play left back as well if needed but not needed because we get 93 rated Roberto Carlos, what a card that is. In goal can we get a big goalkeeper? You know what, 90 rated Courtois is not bad, we are just going to need to get a Belgian for his chemistry. And what better Belgian to get than uh, Kevin De Bruyne? No, it didn't quite work. Um, we could take Morris here. We could go with Gattuso. So I'm going to take Morris for rating. I know we do need two new centre mids. Um, as we now pick up Ribery again, doesn't fit the formation, but for rating, we have to take him. Next up, okay, we get Arda Gula, which is actually really nice for uh, Courtois' chemistry. So we'll play him for a plus two. Could do with a new centre back as well at some point as we now pick up Florian Verts, another upgrade to the team. So can't complain. We do lose one chemistry playing him, but we are up to a 9-2 now with a 76 rated centre back. We now pick up Basha, 91 rated. Unfortunately, well, we maybe fortunately actually because we have Roberto Carlos playing in that position already. We now get Musiala. Um, now, if we were to play him. You would get that German link with Florian Vert. So a good option to have. He is a bit higher rated than um, Arda Gula. So we could do that. We could even take out Zico and get plus one there. And then it's just the centre back. That needs replacing um, off chem. Last chance at a new attacker. We pick up 94 rated Puskas. We play him over Raul. And uh, we're not up to a 9-3 unfortunately. But we must be quite close. We still have that 76 rated centre back needing replacing. We now get 92 Goretzka, which is actually very nice for the chemistry. We'll play him over Florian Verts like that. Come on, a, a new centre back would be amazing. So we get 87 rated Teo Hernandez. Not exactly what you want to see, but for the rating, it is a good improvement. Can we get a centre back here? We do get a centre back here. Literally perfect. 91 rated Sol Campbell. Welcome to the squad. And you know what? We're going to get a big keeper here as well. We get 92 rated Yashin. So we actually lose chemistry playing him, but that's fine because now we can play Zico um, and get more chemistry. We're only 91 rated, but we've got a few 90s on the reserves to bring in straight up to 92. Could this be a 9 3? I'd be surprised if it was. Put in Mares for Amanda and then Teo Hernandez out and Basher in. Oh, it doesn't go up to 9-3. It's a very good draft though. Is there any other upgrades we can make? I don't believe there is. Unless Kane can play Cam, which he can't. He should be able to though. But anyway, let's choose our manager and let's get into the next draft attempt. So into the next draft attempt, we're going to go ahead and take the 4-3-2-1 formation. Starting off with a captain pick of a 93 rated Ronaldinho. Goes straight to the bench, which we don't mind. Our first starting lineup player is 94 rated Pirlo. Very nice to see. So we get another icon in Bastian Schweinsteiger. The last centre mid, not going to be great. We get um, Genie Wijnaldum. First centre forward, we're hoping for like a Croy for a Messi and he, we get Raspadori. Oh, and our second centre forward is not much better. That is not a good start to the draft. Does improve though with 95 rated Mia Hamm. As long as we can get those centre forwards on the bench, we're looking okay. We now get, uh, I think we take Lekebe here. Some Delict and Marquinhos have higher rated cards. And then we'll take Sula, who could play right back as well if needed. Not going to be needed though, as we get 95 rated on a battle. And left back, Ashley Cole has a high rated card now, but he is the highest rated out of those select out of that selection. So we take him. And you know what? 92 rated Vandersar is very nice to see. So we're already 91 rated. We need two new centre forwards. And we needed a new centre mid. Abilai is perfect. Gets us plus one to the chem as well. Next up, we get a new centre forward in Raul. That might even take us up to a uh, 126, you know. We're not 93 rated just yet. 
Next up, we get 91 rated Zico. Another upgrade to the center forward position. We have loads of icons in this draft, by the way. That takes us up to a 126. Hopefully we can just keep getting more rating as we now get, we get 94 Jairzinho, but we also get 94 rated Teo Hernandez, who should be on full chemistry and is a plus five upgrade on the Ashley Cole. We don't go up to a 94 just yet, but we now pick up 93 rated Benzema. Now, I wonder if we play him over Zico. Are we 94 rated? Oh, we're still not 94 rated. We did need to see like a 97 Cruyff or 97 Messi. We have one chance to get them. We don't get 97. We get 91 Salah though on what looked to be a bad border. So you don't mind it. So we need 91 plus and we now pick up 93 rated Kevin De Bruyne. Now, if we play him over Schweinsteiger, we do lose a little bit of chemistry. But it is very nice for the rating. Our first bad pick in a while, we get a Nana and it takes us straight down to a 92. But I believe we are going straight back up as we get 94 rated Nemanja Vidic. What a card that is. Next defender, we get 89 rated Cancelo. Now it doesn't actually um, improve the team, but it's good for the rating. Last chance at a high rated player, we pick up. 85 rated Schmeichel so we're still a 9-2 but we only have two changes that we can make first change is Ashley Cole for Schmeichel we haven't gone up to a 9-3 just yet and then the next change is Zico for a non a plus 15 it takes us back up to the 1-2-6 now if we play Schweinsteiger over De Bruyne we stay at 1-2-6 it's another 1-2-6 and this honestly might be one of the better 126s on the channel. It's not quite a 127. I don't think we can get up to a 127 um, or to get the rating up to 94, I should say. But great defense. Two team of the years. It's just really we needed to see 97s. If we had 97 Cruyff and 97 Messi, I reckon that is a 127. It's a great draft though. Not quite the 127. Let's get into the next draft attempt. So, into the next draft attempt, we are going to take the 4 3 1 2 formation. Starting things off with. Ooh, we're not going to take 92 Puskas. He has a 96 version. So, we take Neymar for the bench. Our first centre mid is going to be Mateus. Very nice because he can play centre back as well. We are going to have to take this version of Bon Matti. Um, would have obviously preferred her 97 version. 94 Abelai is a very nice as well. And our Cam, you know, amongst those picks, I don't mind taking Haji there. First striker is going to be team of the year icon R9. Very nice to see. Can we get another big striker? We get a choice between Lacazette and Pajor. I think it will be a little bit easier to link up Lacazette with that French link. So we do that. First defender is going to be Lucio. Don't mind if this is a bad centre back because we have the uh, Mateus to fall back on. Left back, we get 93 Roberto Carlos at the end. Very nice. Can we get a big right back? 90 rated Pedro Porro. It's okay. It's not, not amazing. Not awful. And 92 Yashin is ideal. So we're currently 91 rated. It's a 124 already. Any big player here, and we should go up to a 92 because we're going to do this and then we are going to do this. So it's a 125 now. Next up, ooh, it's hoping for a big pick here. We only get 86 rated Rafa. That is not great. We now pick up 93 rated Furlond Mendy. Good for the rating, but not good enough to get into the team, unfortunately. 91 rated Lewandowski is a small increase, but 96 Puskas is a big increase. Welcome to the team. We're still only 92 rated. Um, we're probably 93 now if we do that. We are. 
Last chance at a new attacker and it's a good one. It's the best one. We get 97 rated Lionel Messi. Let's take out Harvey Elliott. Let's put him in there. He gets full chemistry because we have so many icons. We play Lewandowski. Does this go up to a 9-4? It doesn't go up to a 9-4. Next up, a new midfielder would be great. Oh, could have been way higher. I mean, I guess we take Taliska. We've stayed at 126, but with picks like this, we probably will drop anytime soon. We now get 88 rated DeMarco, and that's that's what drops us in rating. And oh, this draft has just ended off absolutely awfully. It's, it's a real shame. We, we haven't dropped, surprisingly, we haven't dropped all the way down to 91, but we don't have a lot on the bench to... Uh, to, to use to order it up to get back to a 9-3 we'll see how it goes anyway take out we've got Elliot, DeMarco and Neymar to add on um, we're still a 9-2 we're still a 9-2 at 88 for 86 is that going to be enough? Oh, it's not going to be enough how about if Mendy was playing instead of the Haji? Oh, we don't go up to 9-3 just yet. So there you have it. That's the last draft attempt for this video. Make sure to leave a like if you've enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. And yeah, until next time.